Hi guys, Lisbeth here. Thanks for joining me. I usually say, hi, I'm heading towards minimalism. And I usually am, but I acquired a lot of items this first quarter of 2019. And I wanted to do the one in, one out. Because uh, I kind of tout the, you know, if you buy a new sweater, get rid of a sweater, old sweater you don't care for. You know what, in real life, that's harder than it looks. Because I had just gone through the KonMari as nothing, uh, like the second time, and then when I acquired some things, I didn't want to get rid of stuff in that category. So I ended up getting rid of stuff in a lot of other categories, and I was surprised at how much stuff I still had to get rid of. And I actually have more. I'm probably going to start like a, I don't know, a series, but just a, another couple of declutter videos here real quick. So I'll show you what I, what I acquired and what I'm passing on. So let's get started. Um, the first is I went, I visited my sister in Florida and she was going to pass on some shoes to uh, the Goodwill or Salvation Army that didn't work for her, and I brought, uh, or she sent me four pair, and this, which was my high hopes, it actually hurts my feet, so it came in, but it will be going back out. This kind of hurts my heart some, because I think these are just beautiful. These also came from my sister, but um, I overpronate and I start walking on this edge here and almost falling over. So these beautiful shoes are going back out. And the other two pair that she sent me, I haven't really tested yet. I've had these on a little bit and they seem to be working well. And these uh, suede loafers, I'm probably gonna wait till fall cause it's a little hot for that right now. So I got four in and two out so far. And the other shoes, now sit back down. Oh, this is Ghost, by the way. Ghost, say, say hello to everybody. Uh, the other shoes I have in my collection, uh, I don't want to get rid of any of those yet. So there's two items I need to find somewhere else to get rid of. Then I went on a cruise. And before I went, I had a Target gift card from my birthday last year of which I purchased this top and uh, I'm going to show a bra so if you're traumatized look away and I purchased a bra then uh, my stepdaughters gave me these two beautiful tops for my birthday so that is four clothing items and I didn't want, I'd already gone through my tops, so I didn't want to get rid of any of the tops that I'd kept from the Karmari method. So I got rid of two bras. Originally they were the next size down, I kept them. Now that I lost 25 pounds, I can actually wear them, but they don't fit right. The cups are, the cups are too big. So I'm getting rid of two bras. My husband generously contributed a pair of jeans that are too big for him. He's lost over 50 pounds. And um, my husband generously uh, did two belts. So we got the clothing covered. Still got a couple shoes I gotta account for. Then this, sorry about the moving around. I, sh I was gonna pan the camera and then I just like moved, moved everything. I had a gift card and the only purses I have are black. I have a fancy, a fancy purse, a small like go dancing over the shoulder strap purse and a black everyday purse. And I wanted a summer spring purse. So I went to Charming Charlie's and picked this up. I did have a gift card, but I had to stick a little of my own money in. And I did not have an actual purse to give away then because I only have like three other ones. This was a total, this is a wallet. This came from Payless. If I had not purchased this, which I had planned on purchasing this in a summer purse, this was a total, total impulse buy. 
because this is bone with the white ears and this is white with kind of like a bone colored ear and I knew these wouldn't last too long because of the ears sticking out are going to get scruffy and stuff like that but it was five dollars Payless was going out of business so I've got a purse and a wallet and I had these two I mean I guess it's two in two out but it seemed kind of doesn't nearly take up the room these are small like you just put your ID and a little bit of money in and never use them. So that was the inputs. Four pairs of shoes, three tops, a bra, a purse, a wallet. And it's like, I need to find some outputs. And boy, was I shocked about the amount of stuff I found. I actually, I was just gonna pan, but I actually think I'm going to pick up the camera and move it. The first thing I found are four placemats. They're Santa placemats. The only problem is, and these are cute because you pull out the hat and it's your napkin, but uh, people keep putting their plates on, I don't know why, on this and their glasses and stuff tends to fall over and then I have to clean up the table from you know where the glasses tip and everything. So I decided even though I do, they do spark joy, but having to clean up when other people don't, I guess, pay attention to where to put the glass. So I'm just going to pass those on. Maybe someone would enjoy that. This item also sparks joy and is so cute, but I have it in the upstairs bathroom. And the only time I ever look at it is to notice that the batteries run down because I haven't looked at it for months. So that has happened to me for basically all the years I've had it. So I'm just going to pass on. Maybe someone else can use it and keep track. Uh, let's see. I've got some hair implements, a round brush, and a curling iron. My husband has added three watches to the to the cleanup cause or the KonMari cause. He has one that you just tap it and it and it speaks the time and he really enjoys that. So those work. These are the little cat bowls I got when they were kittens. Now, if you've watched my channel, you know I have enough dishes for a restaurant practically. And why I felt the need to buy <coughs> pardon me individual cat dishes are beyond me, but now that they're grown-up kitties, um, these things really don't hold enough food and water. So I'm gonna pass them on to someone else who maybe has some smaller animals. Uh, this, I'm not gonna pick it up. It's basically a DVD. I had it upstairs, which is hinty upstairs. It's a DVD player, but not Blu-ray, so I don't know if anyone's gonna want that. Some paper. I've got an old made card game. I tell you, I just started looking in other categories and did not stop. I've got one, two, you've probably seen these before because I was gonna get rid of them before and then at the last minute decided to keep them and then was gonna get rid of them another time. At the last minute decided to keep them. Well, I just went on a trip. I did not use these. These are going little makeup bags. These three, uh, like, Play by Sephora makeup bags are going. I've got a hairspray that I've never used. And I already have a hairspray, and I rarely use hairspray, so might as well let someone else use it. I've got some pot of gold window clings I'm going to pass on because they're gel, and my cats try to chew on them, and I don't like that. I've got four of these cups. Now, I'm got these cups you can't see it very well because coming off they all have knights and it used to on the back I don't know if you can still see because it's fading away um, description of the knights I got this set of four when I went to England in 1988 as a souvenir and I figure <coughs> and it wasn't until like the last excuse me pardon me, the last two years that they really started fading. But you know, I've had these since 88 and I figure 
that they were well worth the souvenir and their time has come and I can feel free to pass them on. These two little skull crossbones I used to bring out for Halloween and I noticed the last couple years I never did so I'm going to pass those on. Here is like a um, my grandkids have trouble because when you try to drink on it, this, this cap falls back down, so I'm just going to pass that on. Uh, I don't know if you can see, I have two vases back there and some fake flowers I'm not going to be using anymore. Then I went into the toy realm, and I've got some bears. Um, I don't even remember getting this, so, but must have got it when I bought other stuff and they just put it in because I know I didn't purchase this so it must have been one of those freebies thrown in. A couple um, clothing things I bought for the dolls that never really fit correctly. Uh, I've got a big ride on. My grandson's a little too old for this. There's a little truck in the back and just some out little toys he's outgrown. And I've got some kitty toys that they don't play with. So I thought there's no reason keeping these around and they're pretty big mice, but they like the little ones that they can pick up in their teeth and carry around. And you have these like kickers. They have zero interest in, in these kickers where they hold in the front paw and kick with their back. Well, that might be other kitties, but not mine. And I've got a little wand toy that they have zero interest in. We get a wand toy with feathers that they love, but that one they could not care less. And some little uh, noise makers, which my grandkids actually do like, but uh, honestly, it just drives me bananas. So when you think that I basically started out looking for, you know, something to cover my extra shoes and purses that I didn't have in their category, and I went through the house and come up with all that. So let me get back in the frame. So maybe one on one of the same category doesn't exactly work for you. It didn't work for me. So, you know, I was like, oh no, I tout this stuff and I can't even do it. So, but I was just amazed. I have like two thirds of a table full and I've already done the KonMari method a couple times. I never completed because I never got my photos taken care of. But I've gone through the categories a couple times and I still had this much. And when I was looking around, I see that I probably have another couple videos worth to go through. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for hanging in there with me, guys. Let me know what you think. And do you have trouble with the one in, one out and have to look through other categories and stuff? Let me know down below. Talk with you later. Bye.